M0FXP Hamtech, welcome to my channel. Very quick one here, just testing the power on the 10 watt TID radio H8 model. We're on VHF, the power is at the moment is medium. Let's go to high, so we'll go menu. Menu. Number two, and then we'll just go menu again. High. Confirm. And exit, and then we'll transmit just on a dummy load. Full power, you can see there. So let's just key up. M0 FXB test, 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 M0 FXB test, and you'll find that it's about six and three quarter watts. Then we'll go menu, menu, take it down to low power, um. exit, about three quarters of a watt. And having very low power is quite nice. Menu, menu. medium, exit, same again. Are we still on medium? No, we're still on low. Let's go menu. menu. There you go. Confirm. That's it. Two and a half watts. And if we go down to Nine. 70 SEMs, just a quick key there. Full power at six watts. So, yeah, sorry about these items that keep getting in the way. Do that again, just that one. That's six watts on 70 SEMs. Ten. And about Nearly, well, I would say seven watts on Menu. high power. Confirm. On 70 SEMS, keeps moving around, of course. And this is the Super, you no, know, the Surecom SW02 power meter. It actually even shows the, the frequency. It's, it's a really nice, I've used it quite a few times now. And it's actually really good. It has a built-in battery, nice backlight. You can connect external items to it. There's my little dummy load, so we're not affecting anyone. The HD8 is a lovely radio, beautiful to use. Lovely clear screens, or Motorola style, PTT, dual band radio, weather channels, Bluetooth programmable. You've got a Bluetooth button here, and as soon as you hit that, you can download an app on your phone and program it. So. I think it's a nice set, not expensive, proper torch as well that actually works, you know, a bright torch, full keypad there, and they're about £40, I suppose. I mean, I know we've got the UVK 5s, which um, are popular at the moment, uh, which I really like. I like my UVK 5s, um, but the uh, I think that the, I'm not going to use the word quality, I just, it's more, the, the TID radio is a more of substantial, heavier build radio and, and, and you can feel that when you use it and you've got full color screen um, which means you could probably add a boot up picture uh, as well but for now yeah pc programmable with software of course seven three